So we're gonna do a battle report. It is Sisters of Battle with Guard Allies versus uh, oh, yeah. Blood what? Angels. Clash and Serpent. what are they? Sanguine what? Seraphim. Sanguine Seraphim. Is that like a chapter? Yeah. Okay. Chapter. So Sanguine Seraphim chapter. And we have uh, Emperor's Will with uh, two objectives. There's an objective here for the Sisters of Battle and the... The rum's inside. There's a bunch of rum that apparently the uh, Blood Angels want. How are we celebrating? And um, we have uh, Vanguard Strike, so this is the no man's land down the center of the table. And uh, we already know it's night fighting. We rolled that. We rolled for Warlord traits. Uh, Sisters, St. Celestine has a scoring unit and the... You have not minus one to reserve. Minus one to reserve rolls from the uh, warlord on the on the blood angel side, and then what we have here is uh, on the sisters. They have two exorcists. They have one here. They have one here. They have three penitent engines in a squad. They have a bastion with a uh, quad cannon on top, being s manned by Uriah Jacobus. Um, they have two squads of battle sisters. They have one here stretched out, and then they have one in reserve. They have a company command squad for the guard with a master of ordnance and a heavy weapon mortar group. They have a guard veteran squad with the Laz Cannon. This is subbing in for Lehman Russ right now. And then in reserve, they have St. Celestine with Seraphin, a group of Dominions, uh, Vendetta, and another group of Battle Sisters previously mentioned. We're going to move over here to the Blood Angels now. Tell us what we got. All right, we've got combat team of tactical with plasma cannon, manning the quad cannon. Quad cannon. We've got improperly painted Razorback with twinly glass, carrying the other half of that tactical team. One has a flamethrower. You got the Aegis line. You got the Aegis defense. Aegis defense line. Aegis, Aegis line. Yeah. Aegis. Uh, we got a land raider carrying the Martez and five other death company. We've got the pay no mind to this new thing. It's a bale predator with twin with uh, salt cannon and heavy bolters on the side. This is an, a regular predator with heavy bolters on the side, but that is a twin leg glass. And we're here, don't let your eyes deceive you, but that is a librarian, dre so librarian dreadnought. All right, which can have wings. All right, he's got psychic wings. And then uh, you got what death company with uh, uh that's actually sanguinary guard oh, with sanguinary. death mask and led by Commander Michael, the commander of our chapter, and then two assault squads. All right, and what is this? That? That's just for show. That's okay. not here, actually. That's not actually here. All right, so that's what we got. All right, sisters, do not steal the initiative here on round one. So it is Blood Angels. They're going to start moving, and uh, we'll we'll document so we've got, there. Uh, Blood Angels movement done. Starting on the left here. It's 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 a it's a bad beginning of the game, but we'll see how it goes from here. The librarian perils himself, takes a whole point. Did it go off though? Did he get a double no. one? He got a double six. All right, so he just took a whole point. And then that rhino over there, a Razorback, immediately drove itself into a ditch. Um, as soon as it started driving, so it, it, we have two immobilizations at the beginning of movement, which somehow starts bad, but it, it's only round one. All right, so we're done with the uh, Sand Green Seraphs. First turn, there's a lot of death on the sister's side. One of the Pentadon engines explodes and kills the girl with the multi melta Almost the entire company command squad here has been wiped out, leaving just the commander and the master of ordnance, who've been hiding kind of behind that statue. And then... Um, was there any other death? Uh, Maybe there wasn't any other death. So the sisters fared badly, but not too bad because it's night fighting. And we're going to move on to their turn and see how it goes. 
So Sisters Movement is done. They rolled five for faith points. This pendant and engine has been ditched by its buddy because it's been immobilized. Um, its buddy is running, she is running up there. These girls are charging across uh, sort of in a, a futile effort. The uh, command squad is pinned, as are this squad here, so they're not moving. Um, this exorcist rolls up here. Lehman Russ stand-in is uh, right here, and, and we're on to shooting. So we're going to document sisters shooting, and there, there is no salt. Sisters got first blood, though it took pretty much a lot of shooting to do it. The ball predator went down to uh, six exorcist missiles after Uriah shot it many times with the quad cannon. Other than that, um, we killed two uh, tactical squad guys, and they're running, and um, they got they got done in by the Lehman Russ. And there's no no other uh, things that happen in movement other than these guard got back in the fight, as did the uh, command squad, thanks to the, uh, the giving, being given orders. And uh, these girls and this pent engine have run in this direction. So we're on to uh, round two for... So we got movement for the Seraphim. These guys have fallen back a little bit, but they're lining up to take out exorcists. On the uh, deep strike, Dante and his... or Michael. Commander Michael. Commander Michael and his crew land right here, one inch away from the exorcist. This group lands with the sergeant. It's scattered, but it landed right here, kind of in front of the exorcist and behind the guard. These guys, um, they we forgot that they disembarked last turn, um, so we just put them down, and then they ran over to this quad cannon and, and picked it up this turn. Did not immobilize it, sitting on top of the ball predator. Those guys ran, but they have uh, they shall know no fear, so they rallied, and they're coming back. They're back in the fight. And uh, was there any other movement? The librarian. Okay, so now on the uh, intercept, Uriah here shoots these guys, killing two of them. But they, they do not so flee. shooting is done. The sisters are getting beaten down, but it, it's still just round two. So see how it goes. This exorcist has been shaken, stunned, lost two hull points thanks to an inferno pistol in the side. Uh, Uriah killed some guys here. Those guys, they're outside of the blast radius, right? Yeah. Okay. We, we determine what the objectives do. That one blows up, and this one is a scatter field. Um, this pent engine lost one hull point, but it's not shaken or anything. These guards lost one guard. This Lehman Russ lost Lehman Russ, yes, uh, lost a uh, hull point, and uh, that that was it. So there's a lot of shooting and, and a lot of hull points taken off. But we'll, so we'll move on to the sisters. This dreadnought charges the pendant and engine. It doesn't make the reach, and the the double heavy flamers can't actually hurt the dreadnought. So nothing happens. So we're we're on to sisters' movement. Um, well, a bunch of stuff came in from outflanking reserves. The vendetta here flew in. The Dominion squad there in the back. Um, this group of battle sisters comes walking in from reserve. That was it. That was the reserves. Um, and they have five faith points, and so we're going to move on to actual right, sisters movement. Sisters are actually done with their movement. We're going to get some interceptor fire in a second from that quad cannon. Those um, Dominions came in. This penitent and engine is still immobilized. This exorcist is shaken stunned. That penitent and engine ran or walked. These girls walked six inches. These guys just kind of cluster around a little bit. The Lehman Russ uh, moved. Exorcist moved here. The leader of the squad moves, but he does not. And um, we're going to move on to shooting as soon as he intercepts. Vendetta here gets hit, uh, loses a whole point, but it's still intact. Was shooting. Librarian went down from the Vendetta. Uh, Michael's group lost a couple guys from these sisters with bolters in the back. This group of three guys goes down from uh, lots of las guns and plasma. Two of these guys go down from exorcist missiles, and um, one hull point is taken off this by a group of Dominion who uh, don't really accomplish much We're else. We're done with assaults. Oh, the penitent engine tries to attack the land raider, but it, it's clipping cover and doesn't make it. The girls try to blow it up with a melt bomb. They don't reach it in an assault, and so we're on to round three for the uh, Seraphim. The movement is complete. Michael f walks behind this exorcist with an infernus pistol. He's going to hurt it. These sanguinary guard, are they walk over here so they can hammer of wrath some girls. Uh, Death Company comes jumping out of the Land Raider, which did not move, just rotates. That uh, Razorback? Is that right? Or Predator. Predator turns. It's looking at the Dominion squad and the Immolator. Those guys, those guys are standing on top of their objective. 
um, and outside of the blast radius, and we're on to uh, shooting for oh, the uh, shooting seraphim. has been done here from the uh, seraphim. They blow up the uh, pentaton engine, blow up the exorcist, blow up the other exorcist, killing some guard who are now fleeing from that. And um, what else happened? Uh, that, was, that was it. So a lot of exorcists and pentaton engines were blown up, and uh, and we're on to uh, their assault. The assaults. These guys have engaged here. And these death company have engaged these girls here, and girls really aren't very good at combat, so battle sisters would probably go down. So we're done with the salt. Death company kills all the battle sisters, and Michael and this uh, sanguinary guard kill all the other battle sisters, badly reducing the sisters' army. And we're on to uh, sisters round three. Saint Celestine and the Seraphim come in here. They they hit exactly where they want to hit, and we're moving on to movement with a two faith points. Actually, we're going to re-roll that since Uriah's in the group, taking it to two faith Sisters points. Sisters' movement is done. Still immobilized. Uh, these guys don't move. This moves up here. It is now in hover mode. Um, those guys move up there. Turns again. They can't move. Uriah's back on the roof. And uh, we're, we're on to Sisters' shooting. So we're done shooting. with shooting. We tried to ordinance blast Dante, but that did not work. Uh, there's lots of shooting. Uh, three uh, death company are still alive, but they're fearless, so they're just standing there. Shot a bunch of stuff at this. Shot the back of this uh, with the twin link triple las cannons. Didn't even glance it. And uh, we're on to uh, round four for the uh, for the uh, seraphim. So you've got some reserves coming in. Movement's done. These guys land here. They're going to get shot by the quad cannon. Those guys walk up on the uh, Seraphim and Celestine. These fly over here towards the guard, and that doesn't move. Those don't move. does absolutely nothing, and it can't shoot the rest of the round. Uh, this guy does. <laughs> so, um, uh, if I can make it a ruin. So, we're done with combat here. Death Company is engaged with Celestine and a Seraphim, who actually hasn't rolled for her combat yet, and we just removed the guard guy because he's dead. All right, we're uh, sisters turn five, four. We got two faith points, and we're uh, moving along with uh, what happens. I, I don't know if we covered this in shooting, but the vendetta got shot down. This is still fine. That command squad is totally wasted, and uh, that was that was all that got shot. Movement emulator moves up here. Dominion squad moves there. Turns around, aims at those guys. Uriah's back in the building. These people are locked in combat. We're done with sisters uh, shooting, and. Uh, one guy dies here. That's it. Um, and the hull point is taken off the Land Raider by the uh, Multi Malta. And then um, we're going to go into we're an assault done with here. Sisters. Hey, look, someone's backpack blew off. Um, we're done with Sisters for assaults. This just ends where it is. They're going to consolidate, and uh, we're on to so the top we're round it. Um, game stores close. It's 11 o'clock. It's on round four. We're going to give it to this, uh, Seraphim. They have this objective. They have a Sanguinary Guard here, so they have that objective. Sisters have first blood, and um, Sanguine uh, Seraphin have a uh, line breaker here, so we're giving them uh, the victory.